Hello everyone, I'm Great Look, thank you for joining me, and welcome back to episode 32 of Factorio with the C block mod, where we just killed this worm base in the last episode. We basically spent the whole episode on that, and I guess we need to continue with this now. Let's just have a look at how big it is. It is just one giant and three big ones. Okay. The giant is at the back though. I'm not sure if that makes it better or worse. But first let's find out how far we actually are from finishing this setup, fuel setup. We needed 58 of these. So that's 29 on each side. So yeah, we do need to expand that. I guess we could do the top part first though. That would help with fuel. But maybe we're actually okay on that. Maybe not. In any case, I think we should do that. And then meanwhile, we can get some more iron for more ammo to kill that base, I guess. We did make a small setup back here to produce you know, limited amounts of ammo and turrets. And I guess we need to move that because we need that space if we want to finish this. So it's pretty stupid that I put it here. But I needed it, so I just put it wherever I was. Oh, come on. Well, we need these. And come on, stop it. Probably some of those. Those. And landfill. How many of these do we have? We need more, but this is probably a fine start. Well, let's just grab the normal fish when we see them, because they're good for healing. Well, this requires green science, so we're not going to remove that, but we will just ignore it for a bit. Okay. Do we have flare stacks? No. Can we make flare stacks? No. I used up all of my brick. Oh well. In any case, we need some of this stuff. We can't mirror it though, so let's just take this part. Are we putting it right against? Yeah, we are. Okay. Good. And then I guess we need the same setup on the other side, right? Yes. Wait, why did I see eight uh, liquefiers? Oh, that's for the carbon hydroxide. Carbon dioxide, sorry. So this all should be fine. Can we mirror this? Yes. Good. Probably don't have all of those machines. Nope. I guess we should go and grab iron and brick then. I guess we could set up these along the way though.
Why did we not get that? I don't know. I was probably in the way. And I guess we need to underground below this stuff. Something like that. Let's not have this just yet. Well, we should just drag this, I guess. Also, I just realized we for oh, I forgot to put water into the new uh, electrolyzers, so that's a bit stupid. Can we eat this? Yes, good. Let's just get rid of these. I only want normal fish. So break an iron, and we don't have any space for that, so we should get rid of some junk, I guess. Starting with that. What else do we have? I don't run, run around with these flavor. Also, we have too much belt. I guess we could upgrade our inventory a little bit. No, I think movement speed would be better for actually killing spiders. So let's start with that, because that is a concern I have. And let's put a chest right here with those steam engines and forget all about them. And we need fuel. Do we have some somewhere? Do we need more pipe? Yep. That's a lot of pipe though. Let's make some of it into underground. We need the brick for that. We'll need more brick, and we need to... Well, we can put this in a chest. Put this on, on our belt. Put this down right here, though inside the power range, please. And... I guess we just need more iron then. Five of those. Three of these. We don't need this much cover. We really don't need this much tin either. And then I guess we just want more iron. Can we make a lot of these? Yes. Hopefully that's everything we need. Good, everything lines up like it should. We probably did not grab enough pipe actually. Oh, 
we made too much of into underground pipe. That's stupid. We really just need to make the bottom part, but now we are out anyway. Well, let's just go grab more. We have a lot in our production queue. Oh, I so want all these machines automated. I'm looking forward to that. Hopefully that's enough pipe. Then I guess we want both pipes finished when we start putting down machines here. this pipe not full oh we didn't finish all of this of course also we didn't put any water in here I guess we will just do I not have any more of those nope I will just input it right here I guess for now at least. We need more groundwater balls. And we now have the normal water pump. Is everything out here done? No. Also, we don't have player stacks on yet. Something like that, I guess, for now. They really want to shoot me. Too bad for them. Good. So we have good some uh, good amounts of slag, at least to start with. We still need more electrolysis, but that's for the future. We just want this somewhat set up for now. And then we'll go kill the worms. Or they kill me, I guess. That's also a possibility. That reminds me, the, me that I didn't set up any bootstrap for more iron, or what's it called? Ammo production. I guess we can do that while producing more of these. I guess we should just do it down at the bus. Maybe not a bootstrap setup, but a proper setup. Do we need it for anything? Uh magazine just for piercing rounds okay and even even piercing rounds are not used for anything in particular so we can just make a small setup on the bus but not put it on the bus we should consider how we turn it into Piercing ammo though. That seems like the standard vanilla recipe, so... That should be somewhat easy if I remember anything about how you usually do that. Well, these don't need to go on a belt, right? Why is this not in here, actually? 
Also, we want splitters first to keep all of the belt stuff close together. So, I guess we should do that. And we need basic transport belt for this as well. Why did we not think? Well, we have... No, we don't have it on the bus. So we need to get this past the underground belt. Belt, iron gears, copper cable, basic circuits, and tin. Is that five different things? I guess so. So we need two belts in and another belt in and then and, well, we don't need to put the output on a belt. Worms everywhere. I guess we can kill these manually. Good. Now, the copper cable, we don't want that on the bus, so I guess we should produce it locally. So move everything up one tile. Which means we need cover on one of the inputs instead of cover cable, that's fine. This we get from there. These might as well share a belt. So we can stop that right there. Right? No, we need iron gear wheels to come up anyway. Could have copper and the belt share. Let's do that. It hasn't, doesn't really make a difference, but... Now I'm doing it. Still, we need the belt over here. How are we gonna do that? I mean, we could just do this. And then we wanted copper here. Oh, we have copper on this belt. So many worms. I guess this would be easier with grenades. Let's not tempt fate right now. So that's a lot of what we need for those. Why have we done this all weird like that? And we need gear wheels. And basic circuits, I guess. Now, we don't have basic circuits yet, but we will at some point, hopefully in the near future. So, these. Good. I think we're just putting tin on this belt by itself. Whoops. I didn't have any more of these. Good. 
Wood. Oh, I don't really need this many builds in my inventory. All of this is done. The circus will be in this bar built and just in yeah. So like this. Good. Then we wanted ammo production. And do we want a lot? I guess not, since we don't need it for science, right? But we probably need a full build of uh, iron and then a shared build of copper and steel. We're using all the yellow belt here. I guess that's fine. How come we don't have more than this? I feel like we should. Don't we have four? Oh, we don't have any fuel down here, so these are probably not running. We should fix that, because I feel like we should get a lot more iron in. And of course, all of that comes down to this belt not being backed up. We will have to just bring some manually for now, I guess. And then when we get our, uh, our ammo production set up, we can go and improve the fuel and kill some biters. Oh, and of course need to put it into the machines that need it. Still have fuel here and here. Tin is going to be fine, so it is just this bottom part. Good. Oh, was that put into fuel? Of course it was. I don't know if that ratio is good, but that's just how it is now. That should help a bit. I guess we can just eat these manually for now. Because I want my belt. Of course, having belt production running means that we'll get less iron for ammo, but oh well. So, we want piercing ammo, normal ammo, piercing ammo. Because these take three seconds to reduce, this just takes one second. We need just one for the piercing, right? Yep. So that's how we do it. And then we just scale up just a little bit. I think two machines running for now should be fine. And I guess we should be make, using more grey belt here instead of yellow. So that's iron. That's steel and cover. And I guess this will be our ammo. Eventually piercing ammo for now, just normal. Or do we just store it in chests for now? I guess so. In here. Sure.
page. Just because we have a chest there, I don't want to put a power pole, I guess. Uh, okay. Well, good enough. Something like that. Still need more splitters. And then we need to make sure that we get enough iron in. And I guess we really should be using our spare time on more machines. Don't need exactly how many we need. I know we need more electrolyzers though. And we are break again. Okay. Now this will stop running at some point and then everything will get more. But maybe we should limit this for now. Maybe just me. At least we're getting a bit more sephirite in and thus more iron. We should probably take some more brick. That's probably too much. And... Well, we really just need to go and make more fuel and, and get more ammo and kill some biters. So that's the plan. Go oh, nanobots. I am out of nanobots. Great. Luckily, this is not the worst or most annoying job in the world. So we actually only need those three and we have enough for that. Let's have a look at what we have down in this chest. We have more nanobots. Good. And more turrets and a handgun. Let's just remove that. So, well, we don't have enough ammo to get rid of these yet. How come this is not all being consumed? What have I miscalculated here? Oh, wait. Is it just that we're not consuming the mineralized water fast enough i guess so but why are we not consuming that fast enough output full these machines cannot keep up oh dear that's bad news oh well we need to do some redesigning. Yeah, but let's think about that after killing Biters. I didn't even think about that when designing all this, I guess. And if I did, I definitely did not do the math right. So how fast is this produced? 50 every 15 seconds with a crafting speed of 0 0.75 This takes 5 every 2 seconds with a low crafting speed oh, well, well, Let's do that later as well Let's just get it over with the biters Let's get rid of this pistol Anything else we want to get rid of? 
don't want this. Ammo. Okay. We have 250, that's probably not enough. We used more than 300 for the giant worm last time, I think. I can just do some manually, I guess. And we will just wait around a bit longer, I guess. Of course, we could just temporarily do this. Oh yeah, we limited that. Let's unlimited it, unlimited it a little bit. So that's 400. That should be enough, right? I hope so. I guess we... I'm tired of running around, let's just make a new path up here. Guess we can even go diagonally. Unless that just uses all of our landfill. I regret everything. Well, we need a lot more landfill to get out there. God dang it. I am not very... Well, I don't see the future, I guess. And I just don't think things through. So apparently we need one machine handling the cellulose fiber for each of these. Not one for each four as we're currently doing. You live and you learn. I guess we're just going to make this a lot wider or taller or whatever you call it. me through. I really wish these groundwater bores were affected by the squeak through mod, but they're not. I always get stuck on them. Well, do we want to store anything here? I don't think we need that many turrets. We might as well store most of this stuff. We do need a lot of nanobots. Don't need my gun. Okay, let's hope we can do this. Oh, we need the landfill. Let's hope we can do this faster than last time. Oh, burny stuff. Wow. Did it just get one shot? Oh, well, I'm not gonna replace it right now because. I do not know if it will get destroyed again. So we're just making some space in between these. Do we... Yeah, we need to get closer. Let's 
remove that. At least we're not getting slowed down by these shots, I think. Spirits, ammo, healing, maybe some repairing. And more turrets. Because why not? How many are that? 19? Sure. Let's just get rid of four of these then. No, let's not. Whoops. Because our nanobots can replace them. Come on, nanobots. Do your stuff. Oh dear, there are stuff slowing me down. God dang it. Now we lose all of the <laughs> turrets. Oh, and these guys can hit us. Great. Well, we can't have those three at least, because they're being hit by the other worms. And now we have to, to listen to that annoying sound. Uh, well, we still have enough turrets for another attempt. I didn't even look if these worms actually have splash. Mm. Area of effect 3. Yeah, all of them has that apparently. We need to go fetch my body without dying. Okay. Not the worst in the world. Don't want that, don't want that. Whoops. Just put it in there, please. Let's just put this here for my sanity. And let's get the rest of these, I guess. It was just those three, right? Okay. Let's see if we can't do this a little bit better. Well, I feel like we should just start with these, because then they will draw some of the fire. But I just used all of the ammo. Great job, me. Repairs. Oh dear. Healing. Repairs. Please just kill all of the small ones at least. Oh, come on. Really? You're not gonna kill any of them? Let's at least try and save these turrets without hopefully dying. Okay, let's not tempt fate more than that. Oh dear. Yeah, sure. Kill it all. Oh well. Let's just get these repaired. So we need more ammo, but unfortunately, that's all we have time for in this episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.